He's originally from Paris, France, and made the switch from soccer to basketball at, get this, 15 <laughs> years old. Three years later, the forward is playing D1 hoops right here in South Florida. I had a chance to sit down with Yetna this week, and this young man has a bright future ahead of him. Alexis, you're originally from France. So what brought you here to the States? Um, just the opportunity, opportunity to like be able to play basketball at the same time, uh -huh. discover a new culture, and just like be able to compete against the best players. And you told me you're the only one here. Your family still mm -hmm. lives back in France. Is that correct? But do they ever get to come and visit you and watch you play? Yeah, they do. Like, they're trying to come for Christmas or summer, trying to just spend, like, the, the holiday together. And they uh, always, like, take, a, take time to come see my games, obviously. You're majoring in econ and playing basketball. Wow. Yeah. How are you managing that? My goodness. Um, it's, a, <laughs> it's, it's, it's not the hard. I mean, I've, we have a, good, a great staff in academics uh -huh. who just help us to, like, like, to, to manage like the timing between like, uh -huh. like away games, coming back, studies, practice games, and stuff like that. So it just like we just have a lot of support. So it just like made me they put myself in the best position to succeed on both ends. Why did you select USF? How did you end up here? You pick up a basketball at 15 yeah. years old, which is very late in comparison mm -hmm. to yeah. many players you see playing at the collegiate mm -hmm. level but why did you come here to Tampa Florida to play for USF because I, like, I love the school when I came and visit I love the school the coaches was amazing during my visit they, they always like made me feel like here is like home and just like just I like like the guys here too pretty cool like the same the same the character that that I have too so like I felt like that was a great match for everybody. Now, yeah. you're a redshirt freshman this yeah. year, the only player in the American Athletic Conference who's averaging a double-double. You had to sit out last year. Mm -hmm. So how difficult was that to sit out knowing what you were capable of? Yeah, it was very frustrating. I mean, because I, I always thought we'd be able to play my first year, but unfortunately I wasn't. So it was, like, disappointing. But the coaches and my family always, like, told me to, like, just stay focused and just grinding and wait for my time to come and be ready when my time will come and that's what, that's what I'm doing right now. And what did Coach Gregory tell you? What has he been telling you in order to help you be so successful? Just do, 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 play my game, be who I am, don't change anything and just, just put me like, like, you just give me a lot of confidence to just go out, go out there and just compete. And I'd say you're playing with confidence, mm. averaging a double-double. Are you kidding mm. me? How are you making this look so easy out there? <laughs> <laughs> it, it is not, it is not, but yeah. Me too sometimes just like, like wow, like I'm surprising myself, but I mean, just I just try to just play hard and, and it just, it just come with it. You have a knack for rebounding mm -hmm. the basketball. Once the ball goes up, and it hits the rim, what's going through your mind there? Just like, I gotta go get it. I mean, <laughs> it's, it's just like, it's just like my eyes get bigger. You know what I mean, uh -huh. it's just, yeah, it's just like, I gotta be the first one to get there. Obviously, a lot of season left. What are some personal goals for yourself, and what is the, the talk inside the locker room? What do you guys hope to accomplish? Uh, we love to accomplish a lot. First of all, like, obviously, we want, we want to win championships, like, First of all, we focus on this, this conference, the, the conference like tournament and stuff. Mm -hmm. And then after looking for the March Madness, because that's what we want to do, that's what we want to achieve. And we're not afraid to say it because like we work for it a lot, so we, we that's what we want to, to, to get to. But and personally, I'm just trying to be the best of myself right now, and just out here and compete and just like get better. Always smiling throughout the course of the interview. Yeah, Brian Gregory, the coach, says, you know what? Spread the word. Get some more fans mm -hmm. in that Yingling Center. Mm 